Ms. Haxon Course 2, Lesson 69, is on proper form of scientific notation. When we write with scientific notation, we usually put the decimal to the right of the first non-zero digit. So with 25 times 10 to the negative fifth power, I want it to look like 2.5. Now, I need to be I need to change this 10 to the negative fifth power because my decimal no longer is after the 25, it's in the middle, it's now 2.5. Okay. So to do that, I need to think which way will I be moving this decimal and my 2.5 to get it back to look like 25. Well, I'd have to move it to the right one spot. So if I'm moving a number to the right, decimal to the right, I'm going to multiply 10 to the first power. So that means I'm going to move one place to the right with my decimal place. Okay, And then I still have that times 10 to the negative fifth power. So now I need to combine these terms. So when I remember when you multiply two 10 powers you're going to add the powers together. So if you think about it, I have 2.5 and I'm moving one place to the right and five places to the left. So I end up with four places to the left. So I end up with 10 times 10 to the negative fourth power. So I'm going to move four places to the left. Okay, on this one, I have 0 0.25 times 10 to the fourth power. So on this one, I need to move that decimal place. So it again says 2.5. So first I think, how do I make it look like this first number? I would have to move it one place to the left. So I'm going to times it by 10 to the negative one power. Because I have to move it one place to the left to make it look like this original number. Then I have to put in the rest of it times 10 to the fourth power. So I end up with one place to the left and four places to the right. So 4 minus 1 is equal to 3. So my answer is going to be 2.5 times 10 to the third power. And that's it for this lesson.